Hey everyone, the time has come to reorganize my bookshelf. I have acquired too many books this year and it just doesn't really fit anymore. I am stacking books like here, like down there, there. I don't like it. I want to reorganize it, see if maybe there are some books that I'd like to unhaul, although I doubt it because I actually just am very conscious with the books that I acquire and I recently didn't unhaul already. So we'll see about that, but I'm going to reorganize my entire bookshelf because I'm done with the stacking of the books. First, I'm just going to take all the books off my shelf, put them in piles of a genre, and then we'll see. It is currently 10 a.m. in the morning. Let's see how long this is going to take me. And I just really hope you're going to enjoy this video and maybe it will inspire you in some way to reorganize your bookshelf or to unhaul some books, if I unhaul some books, but I'm just going to do it. I hope you're going to enjoy this video and I'm going to make it into a cozy one. So grab yourself a cup of tea or coffee or cocktail or wine or beer, or whatever, and let's get reorganizing. Okay, so I took nearly all of my books off my shelves, just have some left down there, but I think I'm just going to let them stay there, so I don't have to take them out. But these are all my books, like, it's a lot, but I expected it to look like more or something. Oh my god, what am I saying? This is a lot. <laughs> Let's see, and back here, some more as well. Okay, yeah, this is a lot of books, but I'm really happy just with all of my books. And I can't wait to now put them back on my shelf. I think those things, I don't know, I, I want something different as well, but I just don't really know what. You know what? I'm just going to play with it today and see how it ends up. And yes, <laughs> this that's an outlet. My dad made a hole in there because I needed to put something in there and it's easier like this, as well as down there, <laughs> something else. <laughs> Um, but I'm gonna cover that up with books. But first I'm gonna clean the shelves because they are dusty. Okay, everything is clean. I thought a little bit about what I want to do with the books. So all of the shelves, like these shelves, the ones that are like you know, the ones that I properly see. I'm gonna put all my favorite books there, like my favorite genres, so like historical fiction and non-fiction. So these two shelves will just be my favorite books. And then probably sci-fi up there because those I love as well. And then, I don't know, we'll see. I just want to be able to see all my favorite books. Every time I look at my bookshelf, I'm just like, I love these books. <laughs>
Oh no, I dropped my Titanic book and all the pages were already loose, but now I need to put them back in order. <laughs> Okay, so as you can see, I kind of put all the back, back books, <laughs> the book back, books back, oh my god, where I want them on my shelves. So now I'm just going to make it look pretty. Yes, I managed to get all the books on here and kind of make it look neat. But now the most fun part is like decorating. So I have lots of things over there and over here that I'm going to put back. And then it's going to look all pretty and just fun with some plants and some little bits and bulbs. Yeah. <laughs> it's always like officially done once I put Arthur back on my shelf and it's always scary because I'm always afraid I'm gonna step on one of his leaves when I'm taking him from my kitchen but yes okay so it is done I think it looks a lot more just clean and tidy I will just quickly go through it to show you um, the finished result. So up here I have all of my sci-fi, then like historical fiction, some of my favorite books and some more historical fiction and just some little bits and bobs, some crystals, some um, like necklaces, like a pirate's necklace and a titanic necklace. Love. And here I have like this, um, this, what do you call it? A piggy bank? but then it's not a piggy. Then down here, I have all of my adult fantasy books. Love this Dracarys candle, fits perfectly with uh, Game of Thrones. Then I have some more fantasy, like some young adult fantasy, some middle grade and some young adult contemporary. Then down here, I have some Harry Potter books and some big books like these Peaky Blinders books. Then here I have some thrillers, my like Batman comics and Joker comics and some Dutch books over here. These are some more young adult fantasy books and some young adult sci-fi, just some young adult. Then here I have all of my classics and just some poetry over there. Then up here, one of my favorite shelves is my non-fiction shelf. I have some more room because I just put some random like poetry here because it didn't fit. And one of these cool, I'm always very careful with my scale model, it's so delicate this cool thing look <laughs> that is so cool it's like magic i always like i don't really know where to put it but it fits right here so non-fiction and then up there i have some adult fiction books and then i kind of left that the same but i'm just looking for some new like accessories to put on my bookshelf so hopefully i'll just fill it up with some more like i also have these 
um, these stalls, like origami stalls that I made from book pages. This is such a fun project to make. I have a few of these. Oh, these are very close to each other, so I might have to change that. Um, but yeah, I just love putting some cool bits and bobs on my bookshelf. Oh, I'm really happy with how it looks. That plant is fake, by the way. This one is real, and I'm still so obsessed with this plant because I bought it when it was like right here. And look how much it has grown. Obsessed. Oh, that plant is fake as well, by the way. Okay, so this was my entire bookshelf reorganization. I really hope you liked it and I hope you liked the result. If you've got any questions or whatever, let me know in the comments. And also, if you want to comment something but you don't know what to comment, comment a turtle emoji because I have like a little turtle over there and like a little turtle. Um, cute little turtle. Look! <laughs> They're my favorite animals. So comment a turtle. Of course, you can also follow me on my social media and on my Patreon page. I always leave everything down below in the description. And last but not least, I really hope you're having a beautiful day and I will hopefully see you in my next video.